All right, let's take a look at the cash flows involved in this case. So we've got a $3 million gift. So that's happening right now. That's a cash flow today. And so we're going to think of that as a present value. That's a present value, PV. Um, we're going to have a series of $30,000 scholarships. Those are going to be paid annually. Start one year from now, and they will be paid um, for ever and so this structure has a name it's perpetuity these are funded with a one-time cash donation of three million dollars and so what's the three million dollars this is the present value of the perpetuity here's the perpetuity and so we've got this swap that is taking place donate three million dollars um, and you get a stream of thirty thousand dollars scholarships uh, per year now, first payment happens in year one, so our standard perpetuity formula will work. So present value of perpetuity we know is the cash flow divided by the discount rate. But what are we trying to do here? We're trying to, we're, we're trying to figure out what annual rate of return the endowment must be generating in order for this deal to happen. And so in this equation, we're trying to find R. And we can find R. Let's just solve for R. So R is equal to C over PV, divide that by 3 million, so that is 0 0.0100, there's the answer, 1%. 1% is the annual rate of return that this endowment is generating.